Africa is a home to many exotic animal species, but rather than dogs, you will link this continent with lions and elephants. But that would be a mistake, because Africa is also a place where many ancient and unique dog breeds were developed. In this video, I will show you 13 dog breeds with their origins in Africa. Number 1. Basanji Africa has some very rare breeds, but that is definitely not the case of Basanji, which is quite popular all over the world. It is believed that the Basenji is an extremely old dog breed that predates most of the modern breeds, but they were first described only in 1895 in Congo. Basenji is a highly valued hunting dog with high prey drive, known for its courage, independence and intelligence, speed and agility. Another thing Basenji is known is the fact that they do not bark. They are not completely silent since they are known for specific sound resembling yodeling, but they truly are barkless dogs. The Basenji Basenji is strongly attached to its owner and they are loyal to its whole family. On the other hand, they are typically quite reserved with strangers. It is a curious, alert, energetic and playful dog breed. Number 2. Rhodesian Ridgeback One of the easiest dogs to recognize from Africa is definitely the Rhodesian Ridgeback, also known as African Lion Dog. It is a large-sized dog breed with distinguishing feature, the ridge of hair running on the back in the opposite direction from the rest of the coat. The breed is native to southern parts of Africa and the first breed standard was written in 1922 in today Zimbabwe. They can trace its history to semi-wild ridged hunting dogs of the Khoi Khoi people, who used these dogs for hunting large and dangerous prey and also for guarding. Later, these dogs were crossed with some European breeds, most likely with dogs such as Great Danes, Bloodhounds or some Terriers, but they preserved their excellent hunting skills. The Rhodesian Ridgeback is known as a very loyal and balanced dog breed with very athletic and muscular body. Number 3. Coton de Tulea Most African dog breeds are hunters, but there are some exceptions. And Coton de Tulea is definitely one of the exceptions. This small fluffy white dog is just incredible companion dog hailing from Madagascar. The ancestors of Coton de Tulea were probably brought to Madagascar in 16th and 17th century on pirate ships. Later, these dogs were most likely crossed with Tenerife dog. The Coton de Tulea is Bichon type of a dog with very cottony coat texture. Great fact is that it is a non-shedding breed, which can be excellent for allergy sufferers. On the other hand, grooming can be quite challenging. The Coton is very loving, smart, affectionate and pretty playful breed. They love being around people and they are friendly towards almost everyone. They are also pretty intelligent and easy to train dogs. Number 4. Azawak the Azawak is one of the most elegant and athletic of all African dogs. It is an ancient sidehound from West Africa and it is named after the Azawak Wali. The Azawak is a very slim dog with very long legs and with muscles visible through the skin. The slim body and long strong legs are enabling the dog to be very fast and it is said that they can run up to 40 miles per hour, which is 65 kilometers per hour, which is making them one of the fastest of all dogs. It it is no wonder that they were used to hunt all kinds of fast prey, such as gazelles. The Azawak was also used as a guard and protector, as it is a very alert dog breed and when they sense the danger, they will automatically start barking to alert other members of the pack. But when they are around its own people, the Azawak tends to be extremely gentle and affectionate companion. Number 5. ID one of the rare African breeds is ID. It is a livestock guardian breed from North Africa. They are also named as Atlas Mountain Dog, as they can be found in largest numbers in Atlas Mountain Range. The ID is a very protective breed, which is mostly used as a livestock guardian, but also as personal protector. They also possess good hunting abilities. Number 6. Armand there is not many information about the Armand dog and it is definitely one of the rarest of all African breeds. It is a sheepdog, most likely related to Briards, which were brought to Egypt with Napoleon's army. The breed is named after the town of Armand. Number 7. Slugi 
Another African sighthound very similar to Azawak is Lugi. This breed comes from North Africa from countries such as Libya, Algeria, Tunisia or Morocco. The Lugi is another excellent fast and agile hunting dog breed known for its extreme endurance over long distances. This is very old breed that is creating very strong bond with its owner and its own family. It is also pretty sensitive breed and hard handling is not very effective for training this breed. They need kind, patient and consistent trainer to achieve the best results. Number 8. Africanis the Africanis is a land race dog that developed naturally by natural selection and survival of the fittest in South Africa. It is not a standardized breed and thus there is a big variety in the breed. But on average this is a medium sized and strong dog with friendly but alert temperament. It is usually extremely healthy and hardy dog breed which is very independent and can survive on its own. But of course they love being around people and they will prefer to live in a pack with its owner. Number 9. Burbul one of the most powerful African breeds is the Burbul, a large mastiff type of a dog from South Africa. It is a strong dog with natural guarding instincts. They are excellent for protecting as they will not let any intruders into your property. On the other hand, they are very gentle and playful with its own family and with kids. They are very tolerant with kids but of course you should never leave any dog breed with a very young child unsupervised. They are absolutely loyal and faithful to its owners and they will do anything to protect protect them. But back in the past this dog was not only used for guarding. It is believed that they were also excellent hunters and they were the best dogs for hunting leopards. The name Burbul derives from two Afrikaans words. Bur which means farmer and bull which is a shortening for bullhund which means bulldog. So the name can be literally translated as farmer's bulldog. Number 10. Abyssinian Sand Terrier The Abyssinian Sand Terrier, also known as African Hairless Dog, is extremely rare dog breed. It is possible that they are already extinct, as it is unknown if any of them still exist. The breed is almost completely hairless with the exceptions of few hairs on the head and on the tail, but they can also be completely hairless. Number 11. African Village Dogs the African village dog is not a dog breed, but it is a group of native and indigenous dogs living in various parts of Africa spreading from the north to the south. African village dogs are common companions of African people and they are thousands years old, but they are not standardized at all. This is a list of different African village dogs. They have different sizes, coat types and colors and utilizations. Number 12. African Wild Dog Another not so typical canine from Africa is African Wild Dog. It is a wild animal native to sub-Saharan Africa. It is a highly social animal living and hunting in pack. They hunt in pack with great endurance and they very often hunt animals like antelopes by chasing them to exhaustion. It is quite big and strong dog with average height between 60 to 75 centimeters which is 24 to 30 inches and weight is usually between 18 to 36 kilograms which is 40 to 80 pounds. Females tend to be smaller than males. Number 13. Chinese Crested Dog China is not in Africa, right? Of course not. But latest research say that the breed's origin is not in Asia, but most likely in Africa or in Mexico. And various British, Portuguese and French explorers really discovered similar dogs to Chinese crested dogs across the African continent in 18th and 19th century. But if the dogs truly has ancestry and origin in Africa or not, will probably never be discovered on 100%. Tell me in comments which African dog breed is your favorite. Do you own any of the dogs mentioned in this video? If so, what is your experience with it? If you are new on this channel, consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check the Rocadox links in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.